When it comes to college finals, students have different ways of studying. Some take finals week very seriously and review as much as they can. Others like to keep themselves busy until they have nothing left to do but study. This is the case for two ASU students. Michael Yap and his roommate David Navarez approach finals with opposing views. Michael takes school very seriously. He views finals week as his last opportunity to obtain the best grades possible. The school means a lot to me and I want to study at least enough to get the grades I want. And if I get the grades I want, I'll be happy. I study um, quite a bit for accounting at least. Um, and for all the other finals I'll be studying about five to six hours per final. I have four finals, so about 24 hours. David does not like to stress over finals. I just work on it tonight because I, I have to go to dinner with some friends. He is comfortable leaving his schoolwork until the very last minute. Although he may not study until the end of his day, he makes sure to keep himself occupied doing a variety of different things. Because I feel like when I'm doing homework, I don't feel like I'm doing anything. It's like so boring. I could even be doing the boringest thing, cleaning my room, doing the dishes, fixing things around my house, things that I never thought about doing. And it seems so much better than doing homework. I love to procrastinate. I don't like to spend any time doing homework or studying. I retain a lot of the knowledge that I hear in class during lecture. That's my specialty. Students can study, rest, or maybe a bit of both. Whether students approach finals as a time to stress or a time to relax, it is evident that the choice is up to each individual. Reporting for JMC 345, I'm Jacqueline Solis.